that was the bell. You're late. Take a seat and don't talk. I am Mrs. Crabtree, your new fourth grade teacher. I am just over the moon to be here today. Actually, that's not true at all. Anyway, today we will determine decimals to the hundreds on a number line. I'm sure you need me to tell you what a decimal is. A decimal represents a value that is more than zero, but is less than one whole. Here's an example. 0.93 is read as 93 hundredths. Oh, and speaking of hundredths, that is the place value two places to the right of the decimal. In 93 hundredths, the three is in the hundredths place. Now, let's get to moving or we are gonna be here all day, and I don't have time for all that. Here's a number line. We need to determine the decimal of point C on the number line. C for Crabtree, you know. Point C is between 50 hundredths and 60 hundredths on this number line. I can count each tick mark by hundreds to determine what decimal is at point C. Here we go. 50 hundredths, 51 hundredths, 52 hundredths, 53 hundredths, 54 hundredths, 55 hundredths, 56 hundredths, and there we are. Point C represents 56 hundredths. Wait a second. Look at this number line. He's so big he doesn't even fit on my board, and he's vertical instead of horizontal. Number lines didn't look like this back in my day. Oh well, we need to determine the decimal represented by the point on the number line. The point is between 4 and 70 hundredths and 4 and 80 hundredths. I can count each tick mark by hundredths to determine what decimal is at the point. Here we go. 4 and 70 hundredths. 4 and 71 hundredths. 4 and 72 hundredths. 4 and 73 hundredths. 4 and 74 hundredths. Well, we finally made it. The point represents 4 and 74 hundredths. Thank goodness this is our last number line. It starts in a weird place, at 64 hundredths, and ends at 74 hundredths, but I've seen it all today. Let's find a decimal for point C, 64 hundredths, 65 hundredths, 66 hundredths, 67 hundredths, 68 hundredths, 69 hundredths, 70 hundredths, 71 hundredths, and 72 hundredths. That took long enough. Point C represents 72 hundredths. Well, this fabulous teacher is done teaching for today. Class dismissed.